Hey there, I got this package in from Buck Knives International. I believe that's what BKI stands for uh, on the shipping address here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and open this up with the Buck 110 uh, in CPM 3V. Uh, this was a uh, Buck of the Month uh, sometime in 2022. Uh, don't remember exactly which month it was, but it's solid brass handles and, uh, with a 3V blade and Cerakoted. Um, What we've got here is Buck's Stealth Run number five. Um, comes this nice box, uh, which has a uh, outer sleeve. Let's see if we can get this thing out of its packaging. go all right so we'll take off the outer sleeve <laughs> got rather tight on me there okay um, <clears throat> nicely embossed it says edge of a legend and this has got a little magnetic closure on it all right this is, Buck, uh, this is Buck's Distressed Leather Pouch, which is a little bit different than their sort of glossy black leather pouch. This is sort of gray. Okay. And here is the knife. Um, and the, the headline feature here is that this is in, if I get to focus, CPM Magna Cut and steel. Um, <clears throat> nickel silver bolsters, Honduran rosewood uh, scales. All right, and as I said, this is Buck's Stealth Run number five. Uh, the Stealth Runs started in 2022 with Stealth Run number one, which was also a Buck 110. This is it in Magna Cut, but with brass bolsters um, and a different species of rosewood. It's not Honduran rosewood. Uh, this is the more typical rosewood that we see on most Buck knives. Uh, Magna Cut Steel Blade. Okay. And it's just laser engraved Buck 110 USA. The little marking there. Uh, this one has the symbol 40 or 80. What is that? 60? My eyesight's not so great these days. Let's zoom in a little bit. 60. Uh, for the 60th anniversary of the Buck 110, I think is what that's for. Um, so different marking, different bolsters, different wood, not the same thing as the, uh, the original Stealth Run, but still a very compelling offering from Buck. Uh, and they released this on January 10th, 110 for the first of, or for the 10th of the first month. Uh, so 110 on 110. Um, and then a couple of days later on 112, they released Stealth Run number six, which was a matching Magna Cut with silver, uh, nickel silver bolsters model 112 knife. Um, and that one I will unbox in a subsequent video for you all. Um, one more difference between these two, as I mentioned, the uh, distressed leather pouch 
This one on the left is the distressed leather. That's what comes with the Stealth Run number five. Stealth Run number one came with the original leather pouch. It's the standard leather pouch. So a little difference there. Um, otherwise, it's a 110. You know, it's a very familiar design, lock back. Um, <clears throat> about 3.75 inches on the blade. Uh, clip point. Nice hollow grind. And um, should be pretty popular with collectors. So there's a unboxing video and a first look at Stealth Run number five from Buck. All right, uh, please like the video and subscribe to my channel and you will see lots more knife content.